Oh. My. Golly. It's me. The Coca Crow. I am back. Uh, I've had myself a nap, had a shower, had uh, done all the uh, fun little stuff that I need to do because, uh, yeah, big day of work and, uh, you know, I uh, need that little bit of rest. So I'm streaming Euro Truck Simulator 2 as part of Toby event. If you want to know anything, uh, what to do for the Toby event, I've just put the link in uh, chat. Uh, so you can go to the engage uh, gauge at Toby dot gg slash e uh, ets uh 2022 link uh you can sign up for the sweepstake uh have a chance to win a eye tracker or uh, five copies of euro truck simulator uh so while you're also doing that if you're considering buying a uh, toby eye tracker yourself uh, they're 15 percent off right now if you use my uh Coca crow uh link it will let them know that uh, you've come to uh, the decision to buy it from being on the channel. So, what is the eye tracker? Well, you can see the circle that moves around the screen. That is my eye tracker detecting my eyes and uh, figuring out where I'm looking. Uh, but I also have it set up to do head tracking, which it use, uh, which is what I use in Euro Truck Simulator. So when I turn my head, my head turns in the game. Now, got to get back into it. I was streaming for a little while before, but uh, unfortunately, yeah, I was just a little bit, a little bit too fatigued earlier on, so I had to uh, call it quits. It's time to get back to it and uh, have a bit more fun on the roads. Uh, first, though, I want to come on. Let me do it. Where's my mouse? There it is. I got too many screens that uh, my mouse gets lost sometimes. I'll do a shout out for Kotobi. So Katobi is streaming, my cousin, he's at the other end of the house, also streaming Euro Truck Simulator 2. Both of us are a part of the Toby event. Uh, I think right now, whilst I looked, we were the only, uh, he was the only one streaming. Uh, yeah, between him and I, we're the only one streaming right now because our time zones, we're in Australia, Melbourne, Australia. So uh, we can stream and play games while everyone else is sleeping. So uh, at least you've got some people here that uh, you can watch. And get up those lovely points. Make sure that you have actually uh, signed up uh, and linked your Twitch to be able to get the points for uh, watching people. All right. Oh yeah, that's that lovely head tracking going on. Let's uh, let's get this truck moving. All right. All right. One thing I want to do when I uh, finish this mission is before I pick up my next one, I want to go and uh, look at. Oh, oh yeah, I'm I'm not in Australia. <laughs> in Australia, we drive on the left-hand side, uh, so I just full-on glitched there and uh, automatically started driving on the right, uh, on the left. Yeah, there, there, there. No, on the right. Um, I want to stop and uh, check out my garages and everything. As you can see, I've got $7.5 million to spend. So I might purchase myself another garage and get myself some more uh, trucks to zoom around and make me more money. Money, money, money. It's so funny. In a rich man's world. No, I'm definitely rich right now in the game. Wish I was this rich in real life. If anyone feels uh, like giving me uh, $7.5 million uh, in real life, uh, in Australian USD or American, uh, um, like uh, American USD I meant, or Australian AUD. Yeah, I got that the wrong way around. I meant to say <laughs> for both of them, but I uh, kind of messed that up. Just a little bit. You could, oh, you could probably tell already that I'm a, um, I'm a little bit less exhausted by the fact I'm more talkative. Yeah, like, it's better than yours, damn right. It's better than yours, I can teach you, but I'd have to charge my milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. Hello there, and thank you for the follow. How are you doing this fine day? Kind human of the world. 
this as long as you're human uh you could be an et but uh, if you're an et that's okay i like star trek i won't uh, i won't hurt you you're welcome here <laughs> how you doing thanks for the following what time of day uh is it for yourself to me for me it's the afternoon it's the evening oh, and i'm going off the road Why did that not work? I saw that pop up. Hang on. Oh, it broke. Something's broken. Oh, we can't have this. Why did someone something break? Uh... That is interesting. My my sound alerts are saying that they're not broken, but it did not register the yes queen. All right, let's do another one. Uh, let's do one of my ghost ones. Just want to see what happens. Okay, so that one worked. Why did the yes queen not work? Thanks for trying to redeem the yes queen. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, I want, I'm going to quickly... Sorry about this. Love technical difficulties of streaming. Oh, I like it when uh, I have things and things work, especially when it's using channel points. Uh, all right, let's. Yes, yes, I know. Let me just, just log me in. Log me in. Send, send alerts is being silly and saying, "Oh, uh, you're not, you're not uh, linked." So that's probably why it's playing up. It not detecting that. Uh... Yep, it full on did not register my sound alerts. It, for whatever reason, it decided at that moment not to play. That is, yeah, that that's that's annoying to be honest. Um... Alright, let's go channel point alerts. Let's see if this works when I when I press it here. Yes, queen. Now it's working. Alright, thanks for that. Uh by you uh trying to redeem yes queen, which you just got it there. I was able to find out that for whatever reason my sound alerts decide to play up. Uh yeah. Yeah. So, reason why I got Yas Queen is because I am a drag queen from uh, Melbourne, Australia. Goth drag queen. Uh, there's not many of us around, like... There's people who do goth as drag, but there's not many actual goth drag queens. Like... <laughs> I'm a goth normally, so my drag queen is also a goth, because I'm gorgeous looking. When I'm all dolled up anyway. <laughs> oh, wise. There we go. My mini map was not up. Man, my OBS is clicking on something I don't want it to click on because I can see that I'm gonna. I uh, just. There we go. I had to make it stop. Uh, being focused on the sound alerts. <laughs> Thanks for re redeeming the uh, yes queen. So one of the reasons why I got yes queen as well is uh, because I have a bad habit um, when I get really focused in certain games of not paying attention to chat. <laughs> Which is never any good, so at least having the sound alert that's very cheap, uh, easy to get. People can uh, be like, Oi, yes queen, uh, pay attention. I'm talking to you. I'm trying to communicate with you. I'm going to make a noise just to make you pay attention. Alright, can I do it? No, there's a car coming. Is there another car coming? Yes, there's a truck coming. There's a truck coming. Nope. Over I go. 
So I'm a little bit of a maniac um, driving, but uh, I have a fun time driving. I'm considering tomorrow, because it's Sunday and I was working today, I might even get doled up in drag and stream. Because, um, you know, why not? Oh golly, there's three trucks in a row. Maybe coming around the mountain when they come. Maybe coming around the mountain when they come. Maybe coming around the mountain. Coming to the mountain. Maybe coming around the mountain when they come. It is very strange, like, when I am playing Euro Truck Simulator, they're changing music. Like, I'm an actual truck driver in real life as well. Uh, I drive this same model of Mercedes uh, Benz in real life. Uh, I was doing driving that this morning. I was at work for six hours today on Saturday uh, doing some work. And, yeah, that was uh, one of my things. Get out. Go on. Get, go, get moving. Go on. Go. Go. Don't be so slow. I got off. Bugger. Oh, yeah, right. I'm leaving Russia. Thank God for that. I only came to Russia because I had to for the sake of trying to unlock new areas. I, I did not want to go to Russia. Because, you know, the world we live in right now, who wants to be in this country because of the things that they are doing? <sighs> Not a fun world. Oh, you're going to stop? Okay, fine, I'll go. <laughs> you know I'm just going to go around you anyway. Zoomy. I'm doing the full zooms. Oh my golly. Don't be so slow, people. Cars, you can wait for me. Alright. That's... I, I, one cool thing would be if it popped up um, when you were at the borders. And it'll be like, you have now entered XYZ. my head tracking going on of course when I look at uh, different my other screens because I've got six monitors as you can see I'm playing on with uh, an ultra wide um, gameplay I've got three screens my main screen and then my two my left and right side screens um, and if I look sort of up and right it a little bit that's because I'm looking at chat just right uh, just above is OBS and left and up is um, left and up is me looking at uh, like Discord and uh, Katobi uh, Katobi's stream because my cousin Katobi is down at the other end of the house streaming and uh, yeah we're having a really old time doing our own things in Euro Truck Simulator. Well, I'm out of Russia now, so uh, that's good. <laughs> now, I need a thumb stage for all these vehicles to go straight ahead so I can actually start being a speedy Gonzales again. So, yeah, of course, because I'm a real life truck driver, I don't take. It, like, I don't play too seriously. I, I just play it for the fun of it and mess around. 
I like driving trucks. It's always been like that. Hello, Denny Hell. I am back. Yeah. I am rested. I am napped. I am bowed. I am not a dirty boy. I'm still dirty minded, but I'm not a dirty boy. You know? <laughs> I have a dirty queen, to be honest. I can't remember what it was, but uh, I was at my closest friend's place um, <laughs> a couple weekends ago. Yes, Queen. All right, so now it's working. I had uh, a viewer redeem Yes, Queen before, and it didn't work, Danny. It was it was very it was very upsetting. Get out of the way. Nine percent damage. I don't really care about nine percent damage. Oh, I jumped onto sound um, sound alerts, and uh, I found that for whatever reason, it decided to uh, not give me access anymore. This will be so much easier the day I get a proper steering wheel, like and pedals. Doing those sharp turns with the controller, it will only the steering wheel will only turn so quick. Whereas in real life, I will be turning the steering wheel a lot quicker than that, like a uh, to go around roundabouts so I can keep speed up instead of slowing right down to an absolute piss poor crawl. Uh, I, I went out with my driver trainer um, earlier in the week, they were down to train someone else, um, so they, they came out with me. Um, to one of our, uh, my customer stops and they're like, oh, you're a little bit quick on off the, on, um, on the corners and stuff. I'm like, yeah, it's... I know I'm technically not supposed to do it, but I found that uh, the truck that I drive, if I slow down too much, it then changes gears midway through me trying to turn corners and do other stuff. And then sometimes when I start putting my foot down again to accelerate up, it almost stalls itself. It like tries to change up gear, but then it's like thinking, thinking, thinking. Oh crap! I don't know what to do. Oh shit! I got a neutral. Oh fuck! Oh shit! Oh sh fuck! Okay. All right. Let's go back to the gear you were just in, and then by then you've almost stopped in the middle of the intersection because the weight of the load will slow me the heck down really quick. It's like, okay, fair enough. You're dealing with the the truck. You're driving like. You're not hazardous, it's just not ideal, mate. Yeah, um, the truck is not ideal. Um, yeah, so that was a bit of fun. And then um, I also uh, was having to connect up a B-double set um, because I don't have a B-double license, so I had to take over uh, the B-trailer, the back trailer, then take over the, the front trailer, the A-trailer, connect them up. Um, together and like when I'm doing it I'm like like they have the standard method of how you're supposed to do it and I altered it and it's like so sort of why do you do this I'm like well I leave because I know I'm connecting the two trailers I do it this way because the B trailer I'm leaving it raised high so because the trucks have airbags so when you go under the trailer you lower your airbags so you've got plenty of clearance and once you adjust under it with your turntable you lift up and that way it lifts the legs off the ground and then you can keep reversing back without damaging the uh, legs or anything else with the trailer. A lot of people don't do that. Um, and I said to him, because I know I'm connecting up the A to the B, I'm guaranteed to be doing that. I leave the airbags up a bit uh, when I drop off the B um, and disconnect from it and then drop my airbags down. So that way it's up in the air a bit more. So that way when I come along with the A trailer, because it doesn't have airbags, uh, it, the back of the wheels, of course, with the, the trailer can't go up and down. So in that way, it's got clearance but to go under the B trailer. And then I can um, go to the... the once it's, the trailer is under there enough, uh, it's uh, turntables underneath the, the B trailer. I can then uh, go to the legs and uh, wind them down so that the turntable's uh, touching. And he's like, right, that that's a very good 
pass for me because you were able to easily ex uh, explain why you do it. Uh, it's it's not in the policy, but that is actually something that we probably should think about getting people to do. So <laughs> the driver trainer got an idea off of me because the fact I'm doing this stuff every day. So it's like, I'm cutting a corner, but that cut corner is still done safe. Uh, it saves me time. It saves me um, trying to wind up the legs uh, and all that stuff to get the height that I need. It's, yeah. He's, uh, he was very happy that as a relatively inexperienced compared to most of the drivers, uh, inexperienced driving compared to most of them. Yeah, because I'm oh, newer at it than some of the guys who've been driving for 20 plus years. That I have already been able to find better ways of doing things that everyone does on a daily basis. Um, but also, I'm in a very weird situation where normally people don't split the B double set and drag them separately and all that stuff as well. So, it's... But yeah, it's, it's something he's made, made a note of and he's going to pass it up the chain to his uh, head of training, uh, driver training, uh, his boss, uh, who's the person in charge of Nationwide, and go, hey, if we're teaching people to split trailers and then connect the trails back up, maybe we should do it this way. Um, <laughs> it, it was funny at one point with him. Uh, he was standing in front of the prime mover um, when I need to jump back in and, and do my uh, checks and everything. Uh, he's like, oh, just just do what you need to do. I'm like, yeah, but I'm waiting for you to move it out of way, the front of the vehicle. I, I got to do the tug test. He's like, oh, crap. Whoops. <laughs> he, he was like, he was just still standing there just writing the information down that he needed. Um, not thinking I was actually going to do that. Um because I did do a tug test when I first connected up, but I didn't do a rolling tug test. Uh, he's like, yeah, of course, you should be doing that. Uh, red light, go light. How impatient do I want to be? That impatient. Right, while I'm waiting on the lights, I'm going to blow up my candles. But I sent the counts going. Of course, as soon any time I go to do something when I hit a traffic light in this game, the lights go green. So uh, yesterday I went to take a uh, a drink. It was, it was red, and as soon as I started taking a drink, it goes green. It's like you son of a banshee. <laughs> It's just a viewpoint. Son of a... Oh well. I gotta discover all these things anyway. Ooh. Ah, there's the viewpoint over there. That's... Hang on, wait, what? How are you supposed to do this view? This is a stupid location for a viewpoint. Seriously, game? That's your idea of a view. Dumb. I'm not going to be able to turn all the way around with this trailer. I have to do these silly things to unlock them all. It's a pain. So, what are you up to, Danny? Just chilling out in, in the chats? Just lurking? Seeing what's going on? Just chilling. Nice, nice. So, Danny, here's one for you. 
You know how I got my crazy six screen set up? What if I said to you that I'm thinking about modifying it? Playing some Geo Guesser. Guesser, nice, nice. I'm, I'm thinking about um, raising my screens up a bit because I like how I got it currently. I'm like my webcam is at my eye height, so my screens, my, my gaming screens stuff, I always have to look downwards towards them. So I'm thinking about raising all my screens up a bit. Um, it have to be a fair bit, but then that means I can't have all my screens how I currently have them. Um, like my very, very top screen, it would be way too high up for me to be able to look at it. It'd be almost touching the roof. So I'm going to have to look at where else I can install it. Um, but then I'm also thinking about getting a small screen that will sit underneath my uh, my main screens for chat. So instead of having to look up at OBS, I can just look down next to my stream deck. So yes, I am thinking about having seven screens. But knowing me... Yeah, something like a tablet a type of screen or something. Like a small screen that will fit underneath. Just for chat. I don't think I will do it anytime soon if I do actually go ahead with that. Because I don't have money that I want to really spend on stuff like that right now. I, I want to finish off house projects. I got a heap of house projects that I need to spend money on. Um, I still haven't fudge it. Knew this was going to be a problem. I fudging knew it. All right, I'm going to have to reverse that onto the street. Um, because yeah, I'm I'm finding I'm getting old, and looking down is starting to hurt my neck. <laughs> I've got uh, six 24-inch screens all up, Danny. So, yeah. And because I'm a giant, like, if I was a normal person, the height of all my screens and stuff probably would work because i got a very tall desk. But, yet again, I'm a giant. So... Which way is the map taking me? Oh crap, I do have to go down that way. I might just go up that way and down there. That is such a shitey location to have a viewpoint. Like, you've got no trailer on, that would work. But with a trailer, that's just like stupid. I think I, if I drive off-road enough, they will get the hint that uh, I need a path. I want to see how far off-road I can go here. It says, some areas there's boundaries. Oh my god, there's actually no boundary here. Ah, oh, there it is. <laughs> I just hit the boundary.
Yeah. I, I technically I have seven screens hooked up to my computer because I have my 65 inch TV that has a cable that runs to the back of my computer. I just don't have it plugged in most of the time since uh, it's not at a usable location. Um, but I can plug it in at any stage and use seven screens. Uh, someone's sending me a message. I got a few people that are sending me actually messages for a change, so I need. I have to respond to those messages. Uh, it's just a few things going on. I have to help someone, a family member tomorrow. And tomorrow's Mother's Day as well. So I've got another family member I need to go see. My auntie, who is my second mother. My mum's twin sister. And, and, he, and before you say, why are you going to go see your mum's twin sister, your auntie, but not your mum? Uh, that's because my mum passed away. So... My auntie is my mum. Oh, you son of a... Always! Always just as you're about to get to... Get there. There he is. Bugger off. Yeah, I don't really do any of those sort of things normally. Um, I, I all call them commercialized crap days, Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, Father's Day, Easter. It's all commercialized crap. It's like, how can we make people buy crap? But... Occasionally I'll do things just because I want to, and this is just one of those things where I just want to go see my auntie. Uh, I haven't seen her for a while. Um, and I always know she feels a lot better when I do see her because I'm one of her favorites. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna surprise her with having a little gift for her. It'll make her very happy. As well as I got a couple things for my uncle. <laughs> gotta give my uncle a couple things. Uh, that I've got in my boot. I've had them in my boot for a few weeks. Ever since I did a modification to my car. Danny, don't you think your Toby needs sound alerts? I've tried convincing him to put sound alerts on his channel. But, uh, not, like, just his hydrate and stuff, like, scream ones. You need, you need to tell him he needs some, he needs some Phasmo screaming ones. He needs him, his own scream. Just so he gets his own voice in his head screaming. Just so he goes, what the... It's very funny because have, have I ever told you the fact that I've got um, like when he uh, did the screen um, like when he screamed and and was like oh fuck 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 
uh, in Red Dead. I downloaded it onto my phone so I could send to people. <laughs> so my phone registers that I've got an audio clip that I can play in Samsung Music. So I'll just be casually listening to my music and all of a sudden Kotobi will scream in the car or in the truck. And if I'm in the truck with someone else, they freak the fuck out and go, what the fuck was that? <laughs> I've had it happen a couple times where I've, I've just had either the Kobe, Kotobi going, fuck, 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 or the Kotobi scream go while I've got people in the vehicle with me. It is the, it is the funniest fucking thing. Because they just, you, they don't expect it. I had one guy who was in the truck with me yesterday um, and we almost got back to our depot. I'm like, geez, aren't you glad that none of my really weird music decided to play while we're uh, driving? And he's like, oh, I listen to all sorts of music. Oh, I'm like, I don't know. Do you like music that you would uh, listen to at a gay bar? And he's like, I uh, probably not. I'm like, yeah, exactly. So then I started playing a song called Man Areas. Yeah, it's literally talking about uh, man areas. Mm mm, yummy, yummy. Hairy chests. <laughs> Probably one of my favorite gay bar songs. Yeah, you could say that in my chat. I don't care. I could say it as well, but I'm just. I'm, I'm trying to make it, it, it sink into everyone's imagination. But yeah, if you want to know what song I'm talking about, look up Man Areas. <laughs> uh, a lot of people probably know a, a part of the song because of TikTok. The very start of the song has been very commonly used. And this is what I find absolutely fucking hilarious by females. The start of the song is being heavily used about by females for like dance moves and being all like look how sexy I am kind of thing it's a song about gay guys going down on each other's man areas <laughs> you got the wrong act um, you got the wrong audience right there with that song <laughs> uh You accidentally pressed the space bar, so you left it that way. On on the song, or ah, oh. you accidentally pressed. Yeah, <laughs> fair enough. Uh. It was, it was so funny when it happened. Ah, fair enough. I do that a lot, especially on the phone. Are you on the phone or are you on the computer? Driver has leveled up. Yay! Too. Yeah, because I got such big hands, I always press the wrong buttons on my phone. Because phones are reasonable size keyboards for for just like being handheld, but they're not big enough really for my giant hands. Like, at work, my manager was asking me why I don't have any gloves in my hands cold. So I'm like, yeah, they're cold, but I, there's no gloves that fit me. Like, oh, what about the, the gloves that... Um, you people are taking forever. There. Um, he's like, what, what about our, uh, our large gloves? I'm like, yeah, your large gloves are still large. I need 2X, uh, 2XL. 
I need extra, extra large to fit my hands. It's like, ah, oh, I'm like, yeah. And the only place that I could get extra, extra large are uh, the hardware store. And those sort of gloves might be good for stopping your fingers getting hurt and stuff, but they ain't good for uh, heat protection and stuff like that. They're not, they're not good for cold weather. They actually will keep the cold in and uh, make things worse. Check my maps. I've been down here. Oh yeah. Right, this is my destination here. I'm not too far away from. You know what? I might actually take a detour. Via this petrol station. I'll do that to make sure I actually go into the petrol station. Still getting used to the new keyboard. Fair enough. Uh, I'm trying to remember, what was the model of the keyboard you went with? I know I know it, I'm just trying to think of it. it's not your bird shit keyboard and your people are going what the fuck yeah <laughs> that's a story <laughs> uh it's just one of those weird things that happens love watching oh yeah race black widow yeah it's a fantastic did you you got the chroma rgb um one because that's basically like the only one now isn't it they don't really sell the uh just the non chroma rgb versions of black widow anymore wireless Ugh. Does anything tell you I, that I don't like um, wireless? A lot of... Why did you stop? You're gonna let me in if you like it or not. Yeah, I, 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 for peripherals, I always have to have wired. Like, the headphones, I, I can deal with the most minute little bit of lag that will sometimes happen with wireless headphones. But wireless headphones don't require as much data, um, like sensitivity as a keyboard and mouse, in my opinion. Stuff that's just... And last thing you want is your mouse or keyboard dying on you mid-game. Uh, I'll always stick the wide or, or uh, keyboard or mouse. Love wireless headphones though. Good thing about the headphones is at least it warns you when the battery is about to die. It's beep beep. Oi, plug me in and charge me. And then you can use it while it's charging.
yeah. Yeah, like most of them have long battery life, but I just, I just can't be seeped with the added frustration of trying to charge, plugging in my keyboard to charge, or playing my mouse to charge, or plugging my headphones to charge, and I, like for my keyboard and mouse, I would literally just leave it on charge all the time. So it becomes a wired keyboard, and it's no point being wireless anyway. So yeah. This does not feel sketched at all doing 115 k's an hour in the 70 zone on a country road that is bendy. <laughs> Fifty zone and I'm doing 116. <laughs> I mean, just uh, well, old granny will be walking down the street and just neon truck goes flying by. You young whippersnappers and your fancy new cars back in my day, cars would not go past 45 k's an hour. I haven't had any uh, people make me uh, aggressive towards me yet, which has been a surprise. Look at that silly bastard there. <laughs> Oi, get back to work. Yeah, you scrape that dirt. Oh yeah, you, you're really getting jucked over there. Oh yeah, 7.6. Yesterday when I started, I was at uh, 6.9. So, yeah. Overall, it most make, made a mill just over 24 hours of... Uh, of real life time. I'm seeing it probably around about 30 hours real life time, maybe. No, not even. Oh, yeah. Maybe 30 hours real life time. I've made lots of money in the game. I should just AFK in the game. Just have my people make me money. <laughs> like just a couple of k's away from my destination <laughs> it's got six hours of in-game time to go it says 368 k's oh, look a city guys uh, another city that I've discovered
missions are always a lot more quicker if I just stick to the default part, but <coughs> I want to explore the world and look everywhere. <coughs> unlock everything and then it gives me all the options if i know the town that means i get more job opportunities because i can look up jobs for those areas whereas places i haven't discovered i cannot look up jobs for so more places more opportunities and then it's going to be easier for me to figure out where the good money is at So like when I get drivers that can start doing the, the special loads and all that stuff I'll make sure I have drivers that um that have heavy heavy haulers in those locations so they can make some money for me really quick. Uh, did it make me go into the driveway with one? Like, what a location to have the recruitment agent in for a truck company. In amongst all these apartment buildings. I hope I didn't wake anyone up. I didn't wake anyone. Yeet! <laughs> I'm a crazy driver. If you want to watch someone driving more seriously, go check out Katobi. He's also streaming as part of the Toby event, where uh, they're doing a sweepstake that uh, lets you have a chance to win a Toby Eye Tracker or uh, one of five copies, I believe it was, of your truck simulator. If you check out the links that we're just posting in chat, you'll be able to go enter into the sweepstakes. Make sure you link your Twitch, and for every hour that uh, you watch a streamer. You get some bonus points and more points you have the higher chance of winning no guarantees someone could win with one point get out of my way Yeah, I'm, I'm aggressive. <laughs> I need to repair my truck. They're just like, nope, we're out. See you later. We're done here. Hey, there's a repair shop just up here. Awesome. Oh, jeez, I've already been gone for an hour. It doesn't feel like that. Awesome. Well, I'm full of beans, so it's definitely done me well having that nap and everything else. Because it was like at an hour earlier on, and I'm just like... <sighs> big, big part was I just... I need the shower. I need to... Get all the dirt and dust off of me from work anyway. I, I was a filthy.
Ah, give me a sec. What's going on? Ouchie. I wonder if there's upgrades I can do to the truck. I think there is. I think I've unlocked it. Oh, no, there's something new. Oh! I want to know the difference. Give me my truck analytics. It says it's slightly worse for... You know what? I'm all about that horsepower. Big boy engine. That means, definitely, I need to uh, look at all my vehicles that I have and see, uh, like, in my fleet and see uh, if I need to update any of them. Yeah, I haven't checked out um, new parts for much. Oh, I should have checked out everything else. But the, the engine is the big thing. Engine is the main thing. More, more power, more speed, more everything. More weight I can carry. More zoom zoom. <laughs> as if I'm not zooming around enough as is. Now my truck has... I was at what? Uh, 500 and... I've got like an extra 50 horsepower. I think it is. Or more. Oh, I think I was at 580 before. I can't even remember anymore. It's been a while since I upgraded the engine. When I suss things out or again, when I uh, finish the mission and um, hand it all in, then I will uh, go to a service center and suss out my truck properly and see if there's any other updates I could do for it. Oh yeah, I, I can feel the extra zooms. Oh, I, I can upgrade the wheels. I forgot, I, I got the um, upgradable wheels now as well. I got more options for wheels, which can make your truck more eco-friendly and everything. More eco-friendly, the better. More money you make. Yay! Gives you less money you spend on maintenance. Yeah, so I, I probably have wheels that have a high grade now. I want the truck now to go to 140 k's an hour because of <laughs> I upgraded it. Let's do this. We got 300 k's to go. Papa needs a new upgrade and a new garage and some new trucks and some new drivers. <laughs>
I'd like to move it, move it. <laughs> so the very funny thing is because like yeah, yet again like while well, I was talking about raising my screens up. So when like one of my truck drivers do something, I'm noticing it on OBS before I'm noticing it on my main screen, the, the blue bit going across. The reason being it's almost at eye level for me on OBS. Yet again with that whole me looking down thing. Stupid truck. You were stupid. You were stupid truck. Stupid, stupid truck. You were stupid truck. You were stupid, stupid truck. Stupid truck. Stupid, stupid truck. Also being reckless, so. Not all the trucks fall. Income of six hundred and thirty dollars. Is that all? Oh my god. It's still six hundred and thirty dollars more than nothing. So is that Nobody knows that I ran off. I ran. Oh. You literally pulled out in front of traffic. You got a car next year. You're so stupid. That's what happens when you uh, <laughs> a rock meets um, a unstoppable force. I'll just push through. Yeah, I've just got more grunt than you do. Peppers! Peppers! Give me your peppers! You mean, officer? thing people will say to me now and then is why do you drive a left-hand drive uh, a right-hand drive vehicle on a left-hand drive road 
that on a right hand drive road. Whatever. Oh my god. My words are just awful. Um, again, I, I drive these for real life. Uh, I struggle to deal with. Why do I drive a Mercedes? Because I drive a Mercedes in real life, Custy, and you know this. Hello, Custy. What's cracking? What you doing? My, my Mercedes is more pretty than you. Yeah. Just being cute and stuff. Oh, uh, that might be me, Cassie, but uh, be yourself. I don't know. I always find it funny when these border crossings take you right into the middle of a residential built up area. It's like, seriously, you couldn't have put your, uh, your, uh, border crossing, like, a little bit away from your housing. You got trucks and started having to go through your residential areas. Oh, Custy is always begging for a pegging, especially when pegging is, uh, 100% guaranteed to not cause uh, pregnancy. Bugger the cop car. I don't care. <laughs> well, that truck before just pulling out in the middle of the road when there was a car literally in front of it, like, oh my god. Just cause a traffic jam. <laughs> yeah, betting the fuck over, Custy. Hey, uh, and 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 Custy, if you, if you ask nicely like that, it might end up happening. Like uh, you don't know what's in the works. You don't know uh, if Danny's going to be coming down this way anytime soon at all. Uh, Cause you know. No one knew that Katobi and Yinny were gonna go up to Danny's way. You never know. Yeah, uh, we'll, we'll actually talk here, like with Yinny and stuff the other day saying uh, we should all go to the mini golf one day down our way. Yeah, and it's like, we'll even invite Custy just to be nice. Uh, even though Custy won't show his face because he doesn't like us. <laughs> if, if people were nice to Custy, you wouldn't know what to do. Yeah, let's make all our main roads go through. Residentially. Hey look! It's Custard in the tractor. Hi Custy, how you going in the farm? Why aren't you working, you lazy fool? Oh, Struth! You bloody tractor's broken down, matey! Oh, fucking oath, mate! The bloody Drongo, I saw him from down the right yonder. Come over here and, uh, nip your fucking wise, mate. Oh, fuck. Well. 
Time to get on the tinny, mate. Hey, oil price is so high, I might, I might stop in there and get some. An hour in game to go, it says. An hour and 16. 80 Ks. Ah. You say it's going to take me an hour, but I don't think so. If I'm there before 12, uh... Alright, so it's 11.04, 11.05. So if I'm there before 12 in game time, I bet what the GPS says. But it's also because I'm probably doing twice the speed limit. So Custy, when are you going to get yourself an eye tracker so you, when you play Euro Truck Sim you can do the same thing as us. You just turn your head and you can uh, look around. You don't have to take your hands off, you can you can play your farm sims and, and everything with uh, an eye tracker. Make sure you're uh, in the sweepstake, oh yeah. Get yourself a chance to win. Yeah, it's funny because Custy is playing farm sim. See, I just passed Casty. Like I was, I was saying the other day as well. It would be cool if they did a giant collab where there was, say, a map where there was, a, it was actually like the farm sim worlds, uh, but they interacted with like truck sim. So like, you could do long stretches of driving between towns, truck sim wise, which would then actually take stuff to people in farm sim. Or, like, people in farm sim could give you contracts to, to bring them equipment, which you might have to fetch from a different town for them and stuff like that. It'd be cool. Uh, I'm going to get there before 12... Ah, they know all so well uh, that I need somewhere to uh, repair my vehicle as well. And there's a repair station right next door. That's handy. Why would you have your trailers on an angle like that? I, I, I get it, it's, it's just a parking bay for trailers, but ugh. God damn it. See if that does the job. That's gonna be far enough.
wants to buy over. Mess that up. It was that bait, but it's a bay over. <laughs> oh, their bays with a, a separation. Okay. I was not paying attention. No. So not used to base having these proper separations. <laughs> Just wanted to torture about thinking about the other people. Uh, Pagan. Giggity. Age count. Continue. Right. Back in the game. And zoomy. Trying to get the truck to drift around the corner, but it didn't go so well. Time to do some truck upgrades. change any of that stuff so I had yeah 500 going that was 125 so put it on a bit basically 50 extra horsepower oh yeah and still got the best trend yeah oh yeah uh, that means fine These are PC CP Sim. Seventies is. Oh, 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 oh. Only bad part about that is the bumper's not designed for that skin. 
All right, so I need to actually go. Those are epic, but uh, I have not made the skins for this. Interesting. So I'm going to have to go and do some updates to the skins. I'm going to have to stick a stock for that then. Oh no. Really want that one. Or that one. Like that one I really like, but. Uh, not today. Ooh. Oh, nope. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Upgrades. Oh, heck yeah. Love me some upgrades. Yeah, no, not that one. Nope. Ooh. Oh. Being jiggy with it. Oh, oh! This is fix my heavy transport stuff. I love upgrades. Another twenty six. Another upgrade. Yeah, no, back to painting crime, thanks. Yeah, I'll take that, thanks. No real updates. Oh, 
I want that. Ha 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 Look at that sexy thing. That's that's an upgrade and a half I can, that I can get behind. Oh, fifty thousand in upgrades. Yeah, <laughs> you will live. You might. You might not. All right, let's uh, get into my truck manager. Let's uh, actually need basically get my Alan Merc. So copy config. If there's an upgrade, I can do my man. Still got the strong in the man. I want the man. Good. I don't know why I even have this truck still. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, will you? Yeah, you're gonna live? You're gonna live there, uh, Cassie? Or, or are you gonna be forever upset? Forever upset that uh, Danny likes me more.
Are you son of a? I can fly. Huh. Nice. Upgrade it. Upgrade the beacon on. Oh, I can get up to 700 horsepower now. <laughs> Big zoomy time for, for these trucks. Small upgrade going from that one there all the way up to here. Holy chicken. I don't even use the Volvos anymore. Like, the Volvos ain't my main drive, but... Uh, they'll definitely be my main uh, NPC drives if that's how strong. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I haven't done no TLC for a very long time. These are just my NPC vehicles. NPCs are making so I'm more money with nicer equipment. Make me money, I give you better equipment. <laughs> Do you hear that, Custy? You come over here, get a peg in, make me. It's going to be a lot of money to upgrade them all. Oh, God. All right, let's do it. With the uh, all the extra, they're gonna. Make sure they make all the money after all this money. Got them.
Okay, so now apparently my Volvos are my strongest horsepower trucks. At 7, uh, 700. My golly. Yeah. They're, uh... <laughs> I got all big boy trucks now. They can they can all do everything. I'm a, <laughs> I've gone down to 6.3 million dollars. I started off with at like 0.9 million dollars yesterday. Alright, so yeah, I'm spending a bit. I've not spent money for a while. As you can clearly tell. Alright, so let's go garage manager. A garage purchase. So, got one in Sweden. I got one in the Netherlands. I got one in Czech Republic. Got nothing downloaded. I got one in Spain. I got two in the United Kingdom. I feel like I should, I should put a one down here somewhere, like like in Florence. I haven't really gone here yet, so I don't want to buy one there when I'm not even going there. It seems makes sense to have one somewhere here. Purchase large one. So, Volvo it is. Buy online. Kidding out uh, a brand new garage with trucks. Oh, this is going to hurt my back pocket a lot. <laughs> it's been a while since I bought the vehicle. So, truck manager. Fully upgrade them. Alright, now I've got a whole heap of... Um, brand new. That's good. Improvement.
Right, you're you're a good one. Basically, find these. <laughs> so I went from seven and a half million down to four point eight. So my Merc is not my strongest vehicle. If I really want to do my strong stuff, I should be uh, using my Volvo. Yeah. <laughs> Nice, nice. I've been going for almost two hours. Well, so let's see what's on the job market. Actually, let's see the world map first. Right. Got most of the towns in this. I have got a little bit. Yeah, I got a little bit missing. Huh? A bit missing here. All those ones there. I. I really need something that takes me down this way. Or Finland. Or... Yeah. I want something. What's my mouse doing? These, these nice... Jobs here, I like oof. Helicopters and everything. It's such good to have now. This sort of stuff. Offer expires in four hours. There's no way I'm getting there and paying it. That's the one I am doing. I want to go to Finland. I have not discovered anything in Finland yet. So, it's a lovely uh, $53 per kilometer. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Um, why, why, why you give me this? My truck config is fine for heavy hauling. Thank you very much. Got more juice now than it used to have, so it can do it. Really sucks because I'm kind of like, there's part of me that wants to jump back into the Volvo. Um, 
to see how the Volvo goes with having 700 horsepower. Because it's been a long time since I've drove the Volvos, so I haven't updated them in a long time since they were, yeah, like 500 and something. Let's go the wrong way, because... Yeet! Yeah, Danny didn't have a good day. Yeah, Danny was sending me uh, snapper chaps of, of being unwell in the morning. I was like, oh, no. I do find it funny that I know I'm down at 4.8 mil because I've spent I spent so much money, but I'm still going to have made a lot of money. I'm on mouse what? Oh, there's GPS on this thing, so I can't off oh what I didn't know you could edit oh wow that is cool I did not know you could edit the trucks uh, the trailers No, it's heavy. It's not that heavy. It's only 36 ton just. Head towards the green flag on your map. I don't wanna. Yeah, I never bothered trying to edit the um, trailers. I love having the head tracker active for for looking at the mirrors and stuff now. It's it's so much easier than it used to be now that I've adjusted the settings properly. Yeah, you poor blood it is yeah. Not the fun one. I was talking to Danny before, she was feeling a, a lot better than earlier. Those are the worst. Just the little feeling off here and there.
pounds of my kind. I don't exactly want to go those. Yeah, it's going to be one that one tiny little detour that I'll do when that's it. Rip. Get out of the way, cop car. <laughs> hey, Giddy. Have you seen I got some uh, artwork in my area on the Discord? Uh, one of my uh, friends is drawing up for me. I recently built them a computer that I was streaming the build of. And uh, now just is doing some uh, drawings for myself, which will eventually be uh, used as like Twitch emotes and all that jazz. I'm looking forward to them. I already love them. Like, I gave them a reference. I'm like, something like this, but a little bit in your style because I, I saw all their drawings when I was over at their place. I'm like, you know what? Let's see uh, how you go with this. And I'm like, yep, easy. I, I, I need police sirens. It's based off the drag queen, basically, that uh, I use currently, um, but it's not my personal thing. So I've got a modified version, which is my own. It's based off the, the drag queen that I've got tattooed on my leg. So you, what I'll end up doing is I'll get this version of the drag queen tattooed on my other leg. So I'll have two drag queens on my leg. My legs. That, that's my plan now. It's, I'll get the two different versions. And then in little writing I'll say custard's... Uh, underneath I'll have it say custard's begging for a pegging. taken a little bit more time to uh, pick up speed now that uh, I've got the big big load behind me but uh, not too bad still pick up speed pretty quick and all things considered like the Volvos will definitely do this stuff a lot better than my uh, Merc but oh well I want one of the more modern Volvos. Um, uh, I'm trying to think what the old name is. But uh, one of the companies I know uh, near where I live, uh, sort of about an hour south actually. Um, I could get a job with them, but I'd have to move uh, towards their way, uh, which I don't really want to have to do. And. Um, I, um, I've, I've seen one of their brand new Volvos that they have down there. It's it's their flagship truck, 
uh, now, and it is phenomenally good. It, it's it's sexy. I, I like trucks. <laughs> I like trains. Yeah. So what's on for the evening for yourself, Yinny? What are you doing this lovely night? And make sure, people, if you're lurking and uh, you haven't signed up for a sweepstake, that uh, you do so. Because by watching my channel while I'm playing Euro Truck Simulator 2, which I'll be doing pretty much every single day for the length of the event, uh, you have the chance to get some points to win a Toby iTrucker 5 or uh, even a copy of Euro Truck Simulator 5. Heck, if you're really lucky, you might uh, somehow manage to win two of the things. One of each. <laughs> Who knows? Just put on a cake in the oven to take over to my mum's tomorrow. Ah, You didn't have to make bake me a cake, Yenny. <laughs> you know what? Let's get fuel. Not that I need the fuel. I just want to see where my fuel efficiency sits at once I've got a full tank uh, with the new wheels and all that jazz. Yeah, I, I've got a little gift to go take to my auntie. Yeah, they are. Um, yeah, so I got a gift, uh, gifts for my auntie to give to her. Um, uh, just something small, nothing major. Because okay, my my auntie, my mum's twin, is my mum. She is my mum. She's always been mum to me. Being being twins, my mum and my auntie were always very close. Uh, so naturally, our families are just very close. Like my cousins, uh, well, one of my cousins uh, of my aunties is like a sister. She's always been like a sister, and basically is a sister. Um, and then the other siblings, they're older, not so much, um, but. I started the lost one of my cousins, um, my auntie's daughters, um, to COVID. So, you know, when people say they don't know anyone who, who has passed away from COVID, yeah, I do, a family member. Um, yeah. So, anyway, um, I, I want to go see my auntie. Oh my god, why? Why would you stop there, you stupid car? Yeah. Yeah, it is what it is. She had other issues, but it was COVID that got her. And she was just sort of like, whatever. <laughs> she was over it all, anyway. Um... Um, yeah, so I want to go see my, my mum, my mother, my, uh, auntie. I haven't seen her for a little while and it always makes her happy when she, I see her. Because I'm the one that reminds her the most of my mum. I, I knew that was going to happen. I was looking at that corner, I was just like... This is going to get a bit close, but...
There we go. Um, yeah. Lost a few family members over the, the, the more recent years of my life. Members of my entire life as well, and lost a lot of people in the last few years. <laughs> Bugs. That is life. Okay, so now it's saying with my 880 liters, I will get 1,000. 787 k's yeah so the upgrade wheels have definitely uh been factored into my range awesome i got more range hello there gg bro how are you doing and welcome to the channel um milkshake brings the boys the yarn they're like better than yours damn right it's better than yours i teach you i'd have to charge my milkshake brings all the boys the yard how are you doing and thank you for the follow And uh, yes, that was actually me dancing around for the alert, singing milkshake. Most of my alerts uh, are all based off of little snippets of things that I've actually done before. So, welcome along. And you gotta... Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. Just chilling out, streaming for the Toby event. Uh, is that why you, you've... Uh, Found my channel or just randomly farming along on that lovely little Twitch. Because right now there's an event on with Toby, the eye tracking company, which is uh, what I've got. That's me looking around, move my head so you can I can change my view in the game. And then uh, you've got Toby Ghost, the circle you can see where I'm looking uh, on the stream. Uh, I'm going pretty good, enjoying just driving my trucks. Uh, you know, I'm a truck driver in real life. I'm a drag queen as well. Um, so I, I was driving my prime mover, my uh, Mercedes. I've got an identical truck to this in real life, uh, pretty much. Just not as fancy looking as the actual game one. Of course, it's business colors. <laughs> but um, yeah, I was driving a Mercedes uh, Benz Prime Mover this morning for six hours and then I came home and I started driving a Mercedes-Benz Prime Mover in a video game. <laughs> yeah, it is a bit of a grind with Euro Truck Sim, but it's a fun grind. But yeah, so uh, yeah, right now, Toby, anyone who is watching, Toby is doing an event uh, where uh, people who... Uh, Want to get yourself a discounted eye tracker? They're currently 15% off if you use the bottom link, the one that says Coca the Coca Crow. Uh, use that. You can um, get yourself 15% off, and uh, they let uh, lets them know that uh, you come along because of you're in my stream. If you want to just win a chance of winning a Toby eye tracker yourself, uh, do the top link, uh, the engage link. That will take you to the sweepstake where you can sign up and uh, fill out. All the information there if you want to to get extra points and watch uh ambassadors toby ambassadors like myself and katobi who uh stream uh euro truck simulator in the time period of the event so uh guinea I, th I don't think i've got it uh locked um anyone should be able to do a shout out for katobi if uh you feel like it good work I don't think I limited it. I think I just made it so brand new people can't shout out themselves. So GG bro, what do you stream? Because you got uh, TTV in your name, so you gotta be a Twitch streamer as well. Uh, what do you play, kind sir? Or kind human? <laughs> bro could just be like, g'day bro. Not actually you're a bro. Uh, 
you a uh, truck sim player as well. I got a straight road. I can press my shout out button on my stream deck. It's not going to work for Katobi though because he's not in my chat. Bugger. Alright. Uh, da, 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 da. Just made up the name. Ah, you just made the name and all that jazz. Yeah, fair enough. If you don't want to have the TTV in your name because you ended up not actually streaming, you can change your name to just GG Bro. Uh, quite easily with um, with Twitch, you just go into your uh, settings, edit your username. It'll tell you you won't be able to use that username again for six months and all that sort of jazz. Uh, I rebranded at the start of the year. So, um, my legal name is Skylar. Um, and that's what I used to have my uh, Twitch name as. It was based off of my legal name. Uh, but I decided to change to my drag queen name, which is Coca Crow. So, I am the Coca Crow. Yeah. Alright, so, I can start pressing some of my shout-out buttons in a second. Let's put on some cruise control once I get up to this level of speed. Uh, that should be fine. That's the Yinny button. Ah, shout-out to Yinny. Yinny is uh, someone I play games with a bit at the time. A lot of Phasmophobia uh, with Danny. We, we all love Phasmophobia. It's one of our favourite games. Uh, you should check out Yinny. Uh, a lot of fun. Does a few uh, sort of cherry things at, at times. Did one recently for Ukraine, which was phenomenal. Yeah, Phasmo is life. And uh, speaking of Phasmo is life, Danny Hell is Phasmo for life as well. Um, we play Phasmo together and stream it. Uh, we've had some uh, really, really interesting uh, clips from Phasmo uh, with us streaming. Uh, been a lot of fun and sometimes we've not been streaming and we just so wish we were because of the clips we're just phenomenal um yeah oh welcome uni of course you get shout outs i think you guys should be able to shout people out even though you i don't have you as why don't haven't i given you guys vip or anything like that i hang on this this is this has to be corrected because I don't stream often, uh, well, as often as say Katobi, who is my cousin, who's streaming at the other end of the house. Um, oh, that bunny! Yeah, so there was a one time when Danny and I were uh, playing, and there was a bunny just on a sink, and Danny was like, "Oh, come in here and look at this. Uh, come look at the the uh, at this." And I look in there, go into the room. There's a bunny in the small little bathroom on it on the the basin and as soon as i look at it it the ghost starts hunting and we both scream and run and then yeah of course katobi uh, is also streaming currently euro truck simulator he's on the other end of the house uh, i can actually go down there and yell at him if i wanted to but i don't um unless there's a reason to um i have uh katobi and i do stream together a bit um it's a lot of fun streaming together You would think when you just type in Danny, it would go, Oh, hey, this person here has been in your chat. We'll put that at the top of the list. No. Oh, you know what? You can have mod. Save. You know what? You can have mod. Save. You can have mod, and you can have mod. Oh, you know what? <sighs> How 
custard can VIP. Oops. That was the wrong. Uh, what was his numbers again? It's like three, two, two, three, two, two. Noise, noise. All right, all right. <laughs> Can I maybe get get mod? So, <laughs> the reason why I've given Guinea and Danny mod is because uh, I've known him quite a long time. I just don't stream as often as they like they do and everything so they, they're getting the mod because i just keep forgetting to give them <laughs> why do we all bully custard because it's fun <laughs> uh custy is someone that we all, like we know him in real life but not in real life as such like it, it's complicated Custard works like 500 meters away from where I work. I've seen him in person and stuff, but he hides and he runs away and he, he freaks out. He just, and yeah, we just mess around with him. Yinny has had him do some work and stuff in, in real life. So Yinny, myself, Katobi, Custard, we all live near each other. Danny lives a little bit further away, but uh, just recently, Katobi, Yinny, and Danny all had a meet up for Danny's birthday because it was Danny's birthday just uh, during the week. Oh. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday for Danny. Got a punch her too. Hip hip hooray. <laughs> yeah, it, it's a different kind of keep be, of being me. It's sort of like when you know people really well, like you can say stuff to them. Um and and they don't take offense to it because they know you're messing around like there's that sort of like playful banter kind of uh, it was danny's uh her birthday just during the week yeah yeah there's the train Hey train, bugger off. Two, 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 two. Yeah, that's good. You run away. <laughs> I'm now one million years old. Wonder how many seconds is in uh, thirty one is just as a random thing for 30 years and stuff yeah so <laughs> me, me trying to figure out seconds to years what was going on with that car there uh back in the day i used to play my, on a minecraft server and when people would uh screw up and they were never going to be allowed back to the, on the server i used to have a very trolley way of like getting rid of people I'm 31 myself. Um, so, because people would be m minging and stuff and carrying on and being a troll and uh, hacking and all that stuff. And I'll say, I'm not going to ban you, but I'm going to temp ban you um, for a little while. You can come back once the temp ban's over. And they'll be like, hi, like, because they're not, they don't think it's a permanent ban or whatever. So, what I used to do is I used to ban them for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. No, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero seconds. I then did the maths, and it worked out to be one hundred, uh, no, one thousand four hundred and forty years that I just banned them for. Or was that minutes? I think it was actually it was minutes. Either way, I, I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. And uh, yeah, it was one thousand four hundred forty years. After that, they could come back onto the the server. <laughs> and because it was a temp ban the way our system uh, worked is temp bans you couldn't appeal uh, you could only appeal a permanent ban 
So if, because generally your temp bands were only used for like a day or something like that. So by the time you appealed it, someone read it, you were already unbanned. So we had it so you couldn't appeal temp bands. So these people, I permanently banned them by banning them for 1,540 years and they couldn't appeal the ban. On the list of uh, people to shout out, have a C Elite. C Elite is someone I play uh, played a lot back in the day Minecraft with uh, on Eclipse. Uh, they do play on the String Network community um, Minecraft server, which is a community that uh, Kotobi and myself had started, and it's sort of a community for everyone. Like anyone can join; uh, it doesn't matter who you are. What you do we have people who are streamers gamers artists photographers developers like yeah we've got a lot of different people in the community there's no one set thing it's not just a streaming community or just a gaming community it's a community just for anyone who wants to join in so we always welcome new people into the string network community always a lot of fun and you get to see me post photos of me and drag now and then. The one thing that trips people up when they do join the Discord though is uh, the role system. You have to actually read it and uh, react to roles and that will unlock the areas. It's completely automated but somehow people don't seem to like to read and uh, <laughs> and they don't um, then they don't know what to do and then they uh, start messaging us going oh i don't uh why can't i use your discord i'm like did you read the chat uh the message at uh welcome they're like no uh, yes go back and read it and tell me what it says <laughs> it's like oh then they've actually read it then they do the roles and then yeah each each role you react to unlocks a different part of the community if you play minecraft there's a Minecraft there you can unlock. If they, you want to see Katobi's information, you can unlock Katobi's information. If you want to see my information, you can unlock my information. Why, thank you there, GG bro. <laughs> yeah, gotta be, gotta be yourself, and that's very much who I am. I, uh, be myself. Oh yeah. Be the queen that I am. Yeah. I like to move it, move it. You like to move it, move it. We like to move it. I, I sing a lot uh, to myself. My singing is very bad. My voice is not the best. Uh, if I won the lotto, one of the very first things I would be doing is getting a voice uh, operation. <laughs> Get rid of the Adam's apple. Don't need that. <laughs> uh, I will uh, decrease the uh, pitch of my voice. I want to be very neutral and it's way my voice box and Adam's Apple is, uh, I can't really do it. My vocal range is very limited. So I'm stuck with this ugly voice. Ugh. <laughs> Thanks for the shout out. Was just lurking. Yeah, I figured you were lurking, uh, C Elite, but you were in the channel. And if you're in the channel, my stream deck will tell me and let me know that I can shout you out. I can, I can shout out anyone that's uh, basically lurking in the chat. So I can, if I press my shout out button, it basically tells me like what users are here. Like I, I can press another button which will give me more information on, on the users that are in the chat. But um, yeah, so. I got a few people uh, chilling out in here, which is gross. Custy's chilling out in here. Oh yeah, Custy's still lurking. He hasn't been an old man yet, Danny. He hasn't gone to bed. Let's shout out Druid as well. Ah. Druid, someone I recently met. Um, came across them. Well, they came across me as well because of Katobi. That's generally how it happens a lot with Katobi and I. Uh, Katobi will find people. He's the biggest stream of the two of us. 
uh, seems I got a full time truck driving job that I do as well, so I have very limited streaming time generally. Uh, I have to really plan when I can stream sometimes, like to make sure the house is clean. I got all the tasks that I need to do done. Help people I'm not going to go see them because I spend a lot of time out, away from home uh, on the weekends um, with someone I care about quite a lot. So, yeah. I'm <laughs> just casually going 102 k's an hour through a town with uh, 36 tons of cargo. <laughs> Ooh, Druid was last playing uh, Elite Dangerous. Nice. Gotta love Elite Dangerous. I, I do need to get back into Elite Dangerous. I love Elite Dangerous. I got the full flight gear stuff for it and everything. Just, uh, yeah. I haven't, haven't gone back into it yet. You... Son of a... You are on my shit list now, boy. If I catch up to you, I am pushing you off the effing road. You do not pull out in front of a truck like that, you dumb cunt. And yes, I'm Australian, so I do say cunt. Um... I'm not streaming with Katobi, so I will swear. <laughs> but here in Australia, saying the C word is just a way of saying, G'day, mate. How the fuck are ya? Oh, bloody oath. Having a fantastic day, mate. Oh, Struth, fucking look at that cunt up there in the, on the front of the road. Fucking Drongo doesn't know how to drive. <laughs> and... In those 30 seconds, that's how Skylar got demonetized from YouTube. <laughs> I don't care about YouTube getting demonetized. My YouTube videos there are just literally for me to store my VODs on. Oh, I'm catching up on him. If you don't turn off soon, you're going to be freaking pancake, mate. ha! <laughs> You're gonna be a pancake. You're gonna be a pancake. Na 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 na. You're gonna be a pancake. You're gonna be a pancake. And boop! <laughs> All right. So um, I just clipped that. If if you uh, didn't see it properly. Watch back the VOD, look at my side mirror, and you'll see the car as I, I pushed it off into the gutter, just bounce around and thump into a tree. <laughs> I'm a maniac on the roads when I play Euro, uh, Euro, uh, Euro Truck Sim, because uh, my, my day job is uh, driving trucks, so I'm very serious while I drive during the day. When I'm actually driving, virtual driving, I just I have fun. I want to have fun. I want to mess around. Have a good time, you know? I can see clearly now that van is gone. He's got a few dudes in the side of his wagon. No, that's not right. Just said com two completely different types of vehicles. <laughs> ah, another lovely border. Going from one country to another again. Oh, yeah. Got 545 Ks to go. Oh, punch, punch. I was going to try and overtake him, but then I noticed that the car was coming. It's like, I didn't have enough braking time. Hey, mate, how you going? Um, nice knowing you. Uh, insurance? Nah, um, sorry, I'll just have to get back to you on that one. <laughs> We'd be here in age. <laughs> I like that one. Yeah, we, we be an age. I just tell what people what my age is because uh, 
being the only uh, like Coco Crow drag queen and um, the only person with my legal name in the world, it's like, yeah, if, if people want to find me, they're going to be able to find me. So it's like, eh, whatever. If you just tell them shit, they're not going to really bother looking there. <laughs> and if they go looking, I go, hey, got myself some more followers. Oh, uh, I don't know. Um, our minds are a little bit too dirty for 15. Uh, Danny, like... At 15, were you talking about pegging and and chicken flaps and stuff like that? Like, <laughs> yeah. P pick 17, 18, that's, that's probably about the right. <laughs> right age frame. Oh, you won't talk about it. You were doing it. Oh, uh, Custy is totally 12. <laughs> Bitch, please, I'm 13. <laughs> Does the eye thing appear on my screen? So the circle, uh, I can have it appear on mine. Yeah. So, so the circle is only seen by yourselves uh, on stream, or when I look at my OBS. Uh, so it's not actually on my physical stream, like. Yeah, so I've got an overlay built into my OBS, which works with Toby Ghost, which is a piece of software that uh, takes the eye uh, data from the Toby eye tracker and lets you see the circle on stream. Um, that's what why you can see the circle on stream. A lot of people don't have it bedded in. I've got it bedded into the stream. So it's on OBS that the circle appears, not for myself. I can... Yeah, um, I can turn it on, per, like, if I need to check it, calibrate it, make sure everything's working, I can press preview mode, uh, which will then actually put it on my screen and show me the bores of everything and where I'm looking and everything. I can make sure it's lining up properly, so on and so forth. Uh, but I don't have it on. I don't need to have it on. Ah, oh, arcs away. Ah, it's all good. Um, if you j enter the sweepstake, you never know. You might win it. It'd be awesome if someone from uh, Toby's or my streams won uh, the prizes. But like <laughs> we've always said, that it's like would be would love it if uh, someone uh, won the main prize from one of our two streams. Because uh, Toby and I are. Uh, like the only two people actually streaming Euro Trucks in right now. Um, and we both live in Australia, so time zones are part of the reason. People don't start really getting up in America until around about this sort of time. Like, um, see you late is... Uh, what are you? You're, you're, you're about 14 hours behind me, sort of thing. You'll be about... Uh, uh, it's about 10 a.m. or something for yourself now, see you late, I think it is. Either way. It's morning now for Sea Elite. Um, which is like, yeah, North America and everything's morning and stuff. You've joined the Discord server as well. Awesome! Welcome into the Discord. So yeah, if you just react to the roles in the uh, welcome roles area and everything, it will then give you access to uh, the different sections of the Discord. If you want to See everything you can see everything we got multiple streamers who have their own sections in the discord we've got other people who aren't really active anymore who have their own sections in the discord and sort of we just got that hidden for the time being to see if they ever come back um but yeah ah 
I don't I don't really worry about people subbing to me. I always say to people, if you're better off subbing to Katobi than subbing to myself. Because Katobi at least streams more often. I I can go a whole periods where I don't stream for like a month or two because of my workload in, in real life. Like I can work twelve hour shifts as a truck driver. Um but then other days I might only be doing eight. Um so I tend to say to people, if you're gonna sub to someone Yes, Queen! Now that's working. That was not working earlier on. Uh, for other people besides Danny. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm always just happy having people uh, to chat with while I'm streaming. Because I don't stream as a full-time thing or anything like that. I just stream because I enjoy streaming, enjoy playing games, enjoy chatting to people. That's how I've always been. So, that's what I do. My lights are off. Why are my lights off? Oh, you know why my lights are off? Because I edited the truck. That means I have to... Hang on, I need to stop for a sec. I need to adjust lights because my auxiliary lights are no longer on. I beam on, beacon on. Turn all the lights on. Have you gotten your first do no? What, uh, so what do you mean by do no? I don't actually know. Oh! I got flashy lights everywhere now because I got the beacons on the front. Donations. Oh yeah, I've had donations in the past and stuff. Some people donate now and then and everything. I have people that do sub at times and things like that. When I used to stream a lot more frequently, especially when COVID first started, I was at, I had a lot more free time. Uh, so I was streaming more frequently. Um, I'm on to about six years of streaming. Uh, on and off, like not regular. I got flashy lights everywhere now. This is grouse. I have to see what this looks like on the outside. So let's just stop here for a sec. Let's press F2. Oh yeah, look at those flashy lights. I got flashy lights up the top as well. But all the flashing. Oh, you want to toot me? Uh, my horn's bigger. And... Alright. Let's get back to it. Why aren't you playing online? Uh, so... I, I could start up a convoy if I wanted to. It's just not. I just haven't bothered because I do use a few mods. Um, so like I got a skin pack that I created for Toby, uh, the eye tracking company and everything. Uh, trucks S uh, M P. Uh, yeah, I just. Nah, I, I could do stuff like that, but I never really bother too much. I usually just play with friends and stream it instead. Um, like I could join servers and stuff like that, but at the same time, when I'm not uh, doing things like right now, where I'm uh, I'll, uh, one of the ambassadors doing the uh, Euro Truck Sim event. Uh, I quite often also on uh, Minecraft because uh, the String Network community we run a Minecraft server, and so I play on there a fair bit as well. But I'm also tend to be away a fair bit, so it's just more so right now. It's two weeks of uh, playing Euro Truck Sim. I'll probably have convoys, do things online, uh, do various different things, but also. 
if I play on someone else's servers like trucks, like truckers S um, uh, MP and all that stuff, um, I can't use my personal skins. Like this skin that I've got on would have to be installed on servers and stuff for me to be able to play on them. Uh, because I will only stream with the Toby skins on my trucks. I won't stream if I don't have my Toby skin on. Uh, that's just one of my things, like, yeah. <laughs> I want to advertise the company that I'm affiliated with. And, and who made the head tracker? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's always fun move my head around and watching my screen move. They have the option for... Yeah, like I'd be able to stream it on there, but... Yet again, I, I wouldn't be able to use my own personal s skins that are on uh, Steam Workshop. Because they'd have to have it installed. So, yeah. That's what it, a lot of the time it comes down to is, as well as the minimap, I need the minimap mod that I've got on, uh, otherwise I can't use the minimap. So it's in the center of my screen because I've got a mod that puts it there. Um, and gives me all my information and everything. Uh, if I didn't have that, because I am, if you haven't noticed, I'm playing in ultra wide. Uh, I've got three monitors that I'm actually playing on. But I've only got the main monitor that you can see for the most part on the stream. Then you can see at the very top my rear vision mirror as I call it. It shows my perspective which is the three screens. How did you get the Toby uh, skin? Uh, so if you look up Toby uh, B -O -B -I -I, uh, Fleet uh, on um, the Steam Workshop, it should give you the link to it straight away. Uh, if that doesn't work, try looking for Coca Crow. Uh, that will definitely have it under it. Um, I do think I've I've got it on the Discord. I will make sure I have it somewhere that you can uh, see it. Um, actually, you know what? Give me a moment and I will uh, pack my booty here up for a sec. Uh, so I do need to have a stretch as well. So what I will do is stop here in the middle of the road. Go over to my Discord. Do, 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 because I know I recently posted in the Toby Discord. Yes, Just... Queen! Yes, Queen! Ah. Uh, so, I've got, oops, I got two different skin packs um, that I, I use. I got my truck pack, which is the top one, and then the second pack is trailers. I have not done much with the trailers yet. I need to do more with the trailers though. So. <laughs> I was just seeing some stuff that people posted when I was looking at stuff. Alright, so I'm going to have a uh, quick little break. I'm going to get myself a lovely little hot drink and uh, I will be back. So uh, stay tuned. Ah, nice, nice. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Uh, so yeah, as you can see, this is the Toby skin that uh, I have on the Mercedes. So each truck i had to make a skin for separately there's only one truck in the game that i don't have a skin pack for and that's the baf uh 2021 uh truck it was added um last year and the mod uh the uh, mod hacker or whatever you want to call it mod studio uh hasn't been updated to support the new truck yet and i haven't been able to get templates for the uh, actually no i think i got the templates for the new truck uh there's just no support for uploading with uh mod studio yet for uh daf 21 so i haven't 
done it yet, but every single truck has a slightly different skin pack. Uh, like, let's let's go to my truck manager so I can quickly show you. So, say like if I click on my Volvo, you can see the Volvo has a different skin on it, and then the other Volvo, the Classic, has a different uh, skin as well. They're all similar. They're all blue to purple these ones with the white stripes and toby i have a black version which is black background with the white stripes and toby still but then like say uh my stratus here that's a slightly different one again my man has a slightly different one it's all purple and uh, blue uh, because they're colors that toby have used in the past and then white just to break things up and then of course the toby symbols and then of course my trucks so, yeah. Oh, golly. And that's my first ball. I've done a few Ks on this truck. Yeah, I love it. Um, I enjoyed making them. I eventually want to make more skin packs that will I will um, put up that will have, like, uh, my drag queen emotes and stuff like that on them. So I can drive around with those and have ones that are, like, Toby and the drag queen and things like that and... I want to make up a whole pack which has uh, people from the community that play Euro Truck Sim. Find out what their uh, preferred truck is to drive. Make a model, uh, like make a skin pack for that specific truck um, for each individual person. And then when we do a convoy, we can have that uploaded and we can all have our own custom little skin in uh, one pack that we all and drive around together with instead of having to download 90 million mods we just have to have the one <laughs> right so i will be back uh, momentarily i'm gonna go get myself a hot drink thanks for hanging around and make sure you have uh gone and signed up for the sweepstake
All right, all right, I am back. So, uh, I had a little bit of fun. Um, Toby decided to leave the kettle on the uh, bench empty. Yas Queen! <laughs> but hello there and granny screen i just had to quickly look at something on katobi's stream but my cousin katobi is currently streaming as well uh he's not the only in the house and uh while i was down there scam one of the viewers uh donated bits and uh, i wanted to see why it's yeah he donated it so he could have the bit total as number one and have it as 6969. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. That's the thing that he's got. So, right now I've got myself a chai latte. Um, it took me a little bit longer to get it because, yeah, Toby uh, emptied out the hot water from the kettle to warm up his feet and his legs and then left the kettle empty on the kitchen bench. Like, ah. Oh. <laughs> he fell like Katobi too. Yeah, Katobi is uh, a lot of fun. He's down there in the house and he, I, I mess around with him a bit. Um, I'll get my, some of my wigs and I'll go up to him and tickle him with the wigs and everything. Um, if, if you say in his chat, tickle, tickle, he'll go, oh God. He'll know exactly where you came from. And it will make him start to, to feel like he's uh, getting uh, itchy. I love these headphones, but the one fault with them is the fact that uh, uh, they uh, have issues with the left ear. And uh, they just play up a bit on me. I oh, so annoying. Like the newer versions have probably fixed it of the headphones, and it's like it makes me want to get the newer version of the headphones just to get rid of the fault uh, and the issue, and just not have it be a problem anymore. But at the same time, it's like one of those the headphones still work. I just have to slap it. So do I really want to spend the money on something that I'm replacing that isn't? broken as such it's broken but it's like you know what i mean it's sort of like it it can work so it's like it makes you feel like your left ear at some time is just full, is full of wax and blocked because like you just it's it's there there's noise coming through but it's not the same level of noise Yeah, Danny and I both have the exact same headphones. Ah, wireless 7.2 surround sound Logitech uh, headphones. What are they? G uh, G922. Give me if you hear me slurping now and then that's because I'm drinking my chai latte. Gotta keep myself awake, you know? All that fun stuff. So GG bro, what part of the world are you from? Are you in the States? Are you in the UK? Somewhere in the Europe's? Are you in Australia? Are you one of us? One of us. One of us. 
And if you are one of us, how dirty is your mind? What age is your mind? <laughs> oh, bloody oath, mate. Look at that fucking shield over there. Bloody gorgeous, mate. I hate these fairy terminals and how tight their urns can be sometimes. Yas Queen. <laughs> I love the Yas Queen. Wait. What? No. Oh. Okay, so I was like, hang on, why have I got that town? It's I've got a viewpoint that's just yeah, whatever. Slurp. I'm left-handed as well, which makes it really hard because the, to steer, it's left uh, on the left side of the uh, uh, controller. So I'm, I'm playing with controller. I'd love to have a uh, steering wheel and pedals, but unfortunately, I do not have them. It's an expense that uh, I don't exactly <laughs> want to spend money on at this time. If I win the lotto, definitely, 100%. But if I won the lotto, I'd be building a whole goddamn house just to have a giant area just for streaming. <laughs> but I mean, it'd be like a house that is the size area just for streaming. <laughs> have like a whole like green screen VR kind of area where you can stand around and all that jazz and record stuff and all, all that shenanigans. I have a whole area which is set up just for flight sim. I have a whole area just for truck driving and racing sims. I have a whole area just for watching movies and normal games and Ugh, oh, I'd love that. And I'll have that room set up with a whole area just for my arts and crafts and everything like that because I love sewing. Uh, I love, but I don't do much sewing anymore. Uh, don't have the time. Um, then I do like my electronics. So I'll wire up stuff. So as a drag queen, I will get my outfits and uh, modify them with lighting. I currently have one of my outfits that I want to pull apart and change the uh, the way the lighting is installed. I want to do it better. It, it needs an update. Like when I first did it, was one of my first outfits that I installed lighting and stuff too, and it was good for the time, but not anymore. Now I look at it and go, God, this is awful. Like this needs to be fixed. <laughs> That's how you know your skills have improved with uh, when it comes to lighting design for clothing. Like I was always fantastic at electronics. My electronics skills haven't changed much. It's just the understanding on how to better install lighting into clothing that has changed. Do 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 do.
focus this reel right now. Going around these corners. Oh, yeah. Been going for another three hours tonight. So I did a lot about uh, just under two hours earlier on. Another three hours now. So that's five hours of streaming today. Boybies. That's a little bit for me. Just a little bit. A little bit more. So five hours of streaming on top of six hours of actual work. Yesterday was basically a 16 hour day for me by the time you factored in uh, everything for work and all that shenanigans. I really want to take a drink, but uh, I'm on a curvy road. Well, it's got a slight curve to it. I can see myself messing it up. You know what? I'm going to see how I go with doing this right hand. Put on cruise control. Up. Because I'm covering my face with the cup, it freaks out a little bit the head, um, like the sensors for my head. And it's trying to figure out uh, where I'm looking. And it sort of guesses a bit. Block me, aren't you? Have a great time, have to go sadly. That's all good, uh, GG, bro. I uh, hope you had a little bit of fun chilling out here. Uh, leave me around for the next like two weeks playing Euro Truck Sim for sure. Yeah. See you around, my dude. My people have already made me money. I'm already up to 4.9. Nice! Having the bigger machines and more grunty engines will uh, help their uh, list up opportunities. Start doing some big rig uh, movements for me. All the money. I want your money, 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 money. You give me your money, 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 money. No person made me money.
Yay, another driver has leveled up. Ain't nobody got time for waiting. It's just the eye tracker freaking out because I had a cup of uh, char latte in my front of my face. Get back to work. Back to work. Don't look at me. Thanks for the sword. Yeah. Yeah. I, I was like, I haven't given Yinny or Danny like VIP or anything in chat. Like, why haven't I done that? I'm like, you know what? Bugger it. They're not getting VIP, they're getting mod. Because I can trust them. Custard, however, he just got VIP. So, uh, you get to bully Custard with your swords. Giggity! Hey, you use the sword for a pagan. Casty wants the pagan with the sword. Hope she hit the diamond. Ooh. All the Indu windows. Thirty-three Ks to go. I reckon once I've done this job, I will uh, be sussing just a few things out in the game, and then I will probably. Yeah, I shall pick custard with my sword. <laughs> yeah, I reckon I will uh, probably finish off this mission, um, check a couple things out in the game, just have a look at stuff. I want to see what my driver is actually doing, and then uh, probably call it quits for today um it's five hours that i've been streaming today overall i think that's enough for myself means i also had six hours of work uh, but tomorrow i will hopefully stream a fair bit more after i go see some family uh go see my auntie my mother well, slash mother. I can't go see... Well. Technically, I could go see my mother with quotations there. I could go, could go to a grave, but yeah, you know. Not even a grave. It's it's the ashes uh, in a plaque at my family house. <laughs> Three queens, one custard. Giggity! It's, it's okay, Custy will bend over once he sees me in a miniskirt.
Yay! Ooh. Time for big hauling. I got an achievement. Yay, heavy cargo. Ooh, look at that. I'm a smithereen. An absolute smithereen away from the next level. Son of a banshee. I... It's... Level 6 up uh, perk for long distance. Level 6 perk for high value. Level 6 perk for urgent delivery. <sighs> and it leaves me a smithereen away from level four, uh, 24. You son of a... All right, all right. Uh, I, I have no active. Good, good. I didn't think I did. Oh, I just hit the five. Nice. Now I just got another 2.5 million to go. So I spent like 2.4 million. Uh, two point um, uh, two point seven million in the game. All right. So for those who have been tuning in, thanks for hanging around. Uh, I've been streaming as part of the Toby event with uh, uh, SDS, the craze of uh, Euro Truck Simulator Two. Uh, currently, there's a sweepstake going on that you can enter. Watch uh, people who have uh, ambassadors for uh, Toby. On Twitch and you can gain points as long as you've uh, connected your Twitch to your uh, signed up account on the sweepstake uh, you can fill out everything else to get bonus points and all that jazz uh, if you are considering buying a uh, Obi uh, eye tracker yourself you can get one right now for 15% off uh, use my link which is the bottom one it lets them know that uh, you, you'll get the 15% but it'll let them know that you came from my channel to buy it so uh, Thanks all for uh, tuning in. I will send the raid over to Kotobi, uh, like I did earlier on, uh, when I had to have a snooze for a little while. So, uh, uh, from me, uh, don't be awesome, be fabulous. Bye.